What will do with a drug and sailor? What will do with a drug and sailor? What will do with a drug and sailor early in the morning? Hey, hey, that's your race this way. Hey, that's your race this way. Hey, that's your race this early in the morning. Shame is done with a raster razor. Shame is done with a raster razor. Shame is done with a raster razor early in the morning. Hey, hey, that's your race this way. Hey, that's your race this way. Hey, that's your race this early in the morning. Well, I'm putting me in a long blonde here, so we're putting me in a long Hello Daydreamers, Dario back with another video. Welcome to Empire Total War with the Minor Factions Revenge. I can't believe I never played this mod uh, before. I'm gonna be doing for the first time and we're gonna be playing as the Pirates. And I've been playing actually just a few turns to, to check uh, see how it goes. And we are gonna start from uh, zero. So you can see how this goes in case you didn't uh, know this mod which uh, has been uh, available for over 10 years. I'm going to be playing on the hardest difficulty and this uh, actually is very hard. The naval battles here are very very hard and very hard for me because I have to change my, uh, my usual naval battle strategy. But let's get into it. All right, you scurvy dogs, welcome to the campaign. We are gonna be, this is gonna be the adventures of uh, Zack Sparrow. Because we can actually recruit Zack Sparrow, you know? Look at this, the pirates of Sparrow. We don't have a, a picture of him though, but uh, yeah, he's a, a land unit, pretty, pretty strong, and I guess because of copyright stuff, so that's why we're gonna call him Zack instead of his uh, name and I'm gonna recruit him right away and also here in our port I'm gonna recruit the Black Pearl she's gonna take three turns, boom alright, uh, before anything let's check uh, our domains now as in vanilla you know that they are we are taking charge of the pirate fleets in vanilla, which are all over the world. Not only these three that you can see here, but also in the other theaters that we will check in right now in a moment. So we have our capital in Antigua, the Liguar Islands. And let's see who we are. We are... We have a government. We have a monarch that uh, when I play with Spain, I would really like to have a monarch with all these stars. My goodness, Edward Teach, the black beard, has more stars than 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 the United States flag. My goodness. So let's see. Um, we are Protestant. Population thirteen thousand. Prosperity destitute. Uh, we need to we need to grow. We need to grow. Now the first thing we're gonna do. We are pirates! Um, my goodness, we don't tax! At least now, because tax, we don't get any money anyway. So we're not gonna tax right now. We are... We are steal and, and plunder. So look at that. Six income. 
No, thank you. We need growth. So build a um, uh, basic roads. That always gives you something, right? Something, something, plus five. Nice. Uh, and the other uh, settlement, we have uh, San Jose de Oruña in, in Trinidad and Tobago. And Tobacco. Trinidad and Tobacco. And rum. I mean, sugar. Lots of sugar to distill our rum. Rum, rum, rum. There we go. No taxes for anybody. Macauen Riau. And let's get uh, that. And recruit some uh, sailors free. All right. So, uh, we still, we are getting money. I don't know how we are getting money. But we get plus 4,000 gain from other sources. Such as payments from diplomatic negotiations and protectorates. That's not diplomacy. We are pirates. So, if we check our diplomatic, uh, diplomatic... And relations, we are at red with anybody. And we don't care because we don't like anybody. Nobody like us and we don't like anybody. We just uh, like our mm, brothers in blood here that we sign up with. Now, one thing with this uh, mod, uh, I mentioned uh, at the start, I have, I have to change my um, naval tactics, uh, which my naval tactics usually is to use a chainsaw. I can't even show you here. I uh, use chainsaw and a ton of patience, very long battles. And I can take, uh, if I have a fifth rate, you can do it with the smaller ships, but it takes even longer. But with a fifth rate, you can take the world. In this mod, however, it's not that like that. You need muscle. You need big fleets. And if you fight against five ships, you need at least five ships. And uh, otherwise, it's very hard to capture. I mean, maybe you can win, but to capture, they don't surrender the mother trackers, so it's very hard to capture them, and that's a way to make money, right? To capture the, the ships and, uh, and take the riches. So for now, that the our ships are very, you, you will see. So we have two bricks here and a sloop. I'm gonna send the sloop to cover the port. I always cover the ports when I play uh, Total War, uh, Empire, Napoleon. All of them, in case they come and destroy it, then you have to fix and expend money. Ship and, shape and Bristol fashion. Uh, we, we could um, raid, but I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna just hide away like a like a coward behind the the the, uh, the skirt of my mother, <laughs> because we have one um, Netherlands uh, mother trackers uh, fleet in here that is gonna attack us. And we have a Spanish fleet in here. I don't think there's a British around this area. Maybe they are. I don't remember exactly. But those two for sure. So we need to avoid that. For now, we cover our ports. And um, one thing I'm gonna do is this port. I'm gonna upgrade it right away. So if, if you see the first one, you can recruit two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. This gun. I this gun. This son of a gun. <laughs> this one. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14. So, so I think it upgrades from a light frigate to a heavy frigate. Which is going to be very nice. And we select it. Now, in our capital though, port. In uh, Guadalupe. I'm not going to upgrade it right now. Because I think I'm going to try. I haven't tried this. But I'm going to try it. I want to demolish this. And... Instead of the shipyard, go for a trade uh, trading port. Even though we cannot trade with anybody, but if we send ships to one of the trade nodes and our home uh, region, our capital region has a port of trading port, I think you can get income from it. So I want to try that. I want to send some ships in there and put here a trading uh, port. If we get income, perfect. If we don't get income, then forget it. I don't need to go there to play ships only to raid other ships but uh, no need to to build any trading ships of our own and I change back to to the military tree and that's it but I want to try it because if we can get income that way uh, that's uh, you know, the, the more income we get the better and the ship wise is more or less the same the only thing that we don't get with the trading is the frigates so the light frigate and the heavy frigate, we won't be able to recruit it. But we have some special uh, ships, 
like I just uh, show you the black belt that we are recruiting already. We have Queen Anne's Revenge, uh, Beastie Ship. We have the Ranger uh, from who's this guy? Captain Benjamin Homigold. We have the White Akali from S Black Sam, I think it is. Yeah, Black Sam. Samuel Bellamy, Black Sam. And we have the Royal Fortune from Bartholomew Roberts. The William from Calico Jack. John Rackman, Calico Jack. Calico, Calico, Calico. So tasty <laughs> in Spanish, Calico. And there was another one, that uh, the Jack Draw. The Jack Draw by the assassin Edward Kenway. Okay, we will uh, check those later. But um, what I was mentioning, if we go to the military, we have exactly the same except the light frigate. And when you upgrade, you also get the heavy frigate. But then if you keep upgrading, I don't see any more ships. So I don't think we need to upgrade anymore. We, we will see it on the road when we arrive to that point. Okay, so we were recruiting. Uh, I'm going to upgrade this as well. The Pirates Cove. So we can recruit. Look at this. Besides the uh, Pirates of Sparrow, we have Raiders on the Storm. We have Pirate Arm. We are so flipping OP, to be honest. Uh, our units are, s compared with with the, the others around, we are pretty powerful. And the garrisons actually in the Caribbean, they are pretty shitty, pretty crappy at the, at the beginning of the game. So you can really rampage through, at least, uh, if we can get through the ships, that's, that's, that's the main thing. Curaçao and uh, Martinique. Martinique. Yeah, they are trading now. So it's good. Later we will be able to uh, raid the lines and all that. But uh, we will need to... I mean, I would like to find a mod, guys, honestly. I would like to find a mod where we could do the uh, true pirate experience. Which for me is to use, uh, like, go one ship. Like uh, these ones that we have, like the Black Pearl, for example, right? Or we go with these uh, historical ones. The White Akali. I don't believe that Black Sam was uh, sailing with 10 ships on his side. They used to go al alone, raiding wherever they could, because the more ships that they have, the more you have to share your, the plunder, right? And we want plunder. Na 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 na. Plunder. We don't want to share it. So. But with this mod, for example, it's impossible. I, I go alone and and you die. So what I want to do is to find another mod. I, I want to play this because it's a lot of fun. It looks pretty, pretty, pretty nice. But I would like to find another mod to play as the pirates and be able to do my usual tactics. And if I have a fifth rate, take a, a, a ten f uh, ships uh, fleet and then sell it all. I don't need to tax ever. I don't need to conquer, I just a couple islands to, you know, because we are not farmers. We don't want to f f make him farm and uh, in a plantation and build the roads and all this crap. If I want to tax and all that, I, I live in my uh, country of birth. I don't come here with my, um, we are thugs and mother truckers. We just uh, plunder and... and and we don't build ships either. We don't recruit ships. We steal them. That's what I want to do. And uh, I want to find a mod to, to do that. And I'm, I'm searching, guys. I'm searching that. And when I do it, I will start another pirate campaign with that. In the meantime, we're going to play this. This is going to be a lot of fun. Now, and objectives, what would it be? Uh, well, before anything, uh, maybe uh, yeah, the islands around here. And I didn't mention, I started playing with the six turns per year. So it, the, the years are going to take uh, quite some time. Now, the time of pir piracy, historically, was like uh, until 1720, 1730. So I think my main goal is going to be survive. See if I can survive si without taxing. <laughs> uh, and around here, I don't, I don't want to conquer the world. I don't want to conquer uh, New Spain and all that. But in this mode, I might have to to survive, to have enough uh, income and all that. But uh, 
let's say if we made it make it to 1720 1730 i would be happy with that and uh, let's see what adventures we 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 see during that but anyway enough talking let's just keep moving so i know there is actually uh, is here <laughs> i think it's here the spanish fleet so we are gonna go very cowardly uh, this this way don't don't see me Okay, and um, from here the idea is to get together with our with our other fleets in in there, and these guys fleet. that we have a fluid uh, a brick and a sloop. It's very tempting to go and I can't click in there now because I need to move a little bit before because it's uh, you know for the start post file and all that. It's very tempting to come and uh, uh, plunder the lines, but this fleet in here is going to attack us for sure. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come all the way up here. So if they come, uh, I will be able to flee, to retreat, and they won't have enough movement points to catch me. And I'm hoping that uh, on this side as well, when they come, they don't follow to... Otherwise, we, you have to fight by uh, uh, the Article 33, and we're going to lose, most probably. So anyway, let me check here, since we discover Santo Domingo. Look at the colonial militia. These guys have cannons. Uh, not bad. But anyway, so let me see the other fleets. We have more fleets, guys. We have uh, East Indies. Okay. So... Well, I did some testing before bringing this, and I did try actually. There's a, a Netherlands trade fleet in here of seven ships, and yeah, you can't do it. No, not with this. Uh, where is this? A fifth rate. You can't do it. I tried it; it was no problem. Now with uh, another mods that I use in in Empire Total War, you can check uh, my playthroughs uh, on the channel. With one fifth rate, I could take those seven and another seven. Uh, the fourteen, I could take whatever, but here is impossible. So anyway, let's go to the Caribbean. We're the Pirates of the Caribbean. Ready and waiting. So we are gonna get together and make ourselves stronger, stronger. Uh, India, no. We are going to America. Welcome to America! And we have one more. Here at the Ivory Coast. What's the cost of the Ivory? If you stay here and plan there, whatever, the, they're gonna start. The, um, the other nations are gonna start sending fleets, and you can't do anything with, uh, with what we have in here. So let's go to America. Once we get all together, we take control of the Caribbean. I don't want to uh, break the ports and all that because actually if the enemies build ships and all that is more money that we can plunder later. But let's uh, get all the um, all the fleets together and, and see what we can become stronger in here. Did I recruit something down here? No, I didn't. So because I already know because I did the testing and all that, we have the uh, blah, blah, blah. one turn are very small two turns we have this uh, historically accurate uh, very nice fleets uh, ships and i'm gonna get this one the white agali because uh, it's only two turns and has 48 cannons this one i are two turns also see so this one but this uh, 32 32 cannons and this one is a light frigate that uh, is not named after anybody this one is also 48 but it's three turns and this one is two turns, but 28 cannons. So this one. That's it. And I already recruited. Oh, we didn't upgrade this. Uh, this we will upgrade also. Let me show you. So we need to upgrade that. We can recruit a few more units. And then we can choose to either go military governors encampment. That is the same thing that we have in Antigua. Or we can go this other route. That is what I'm going to do. The governor's man mansion. 
because at the end we have the refugee for the smugglers and you can get very special we can get the smugglers cannons hand mortar i mean this they're gonna be this is gonna be awesome and in our capital actually what we are gonna get is um we'll continue to get we already, already building the pirate scope which will give us cannons as well uh, only cannons but then we go to Blackbeard's Cove and we can recruit back Blackbeard himself look at that <laughs> and the Philly Busters the Ghostbusters uh, African Musketeers Brethren of the Coast well, this is gonna be amazing and we are gonna storm the Caribbean and who are we let me see our we have a family tree guys uh, look at this so blackbeard is our king right edward the first and <laughs> juanita <laughs> that has a, a lot of facial hair <laughs> i guess is the <laughs> the 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 wife we have two children uh roch roch has 12 is 12 years old with no no kids come on lad you are 12 already and uh, Jean Louis is six and is single with no children as well. And other claimants, uh, Emmanuel, age 54, married with four children. Uh, age 48, married with four children. And Bartholomew, age 41, married with uh, three children and 15 pastors. <laughs> My goodness. Anyway, so I think we are ready to pass on. All right, just took the chance to make a save in this uh, in the game and let's go. We're gonna get attacked somewhere or everywhere. <laughs> Netherlands, here they come. Okay, so let's just make a save just in case I can't uh, get away. Um, the Netherlands fleet and retreat they didn't come they didn't have movement points okay here the same thing we're gonna call it the Spanish fleet uh, Yes, I will write it because that's from the other in the test that I did before. Sail for oh the shit, over here! I was hoping it wa was gonna go that way. Well, they didn't p pursue because they didn't have a uh, movement points either, so that's all right. If we fight them, we are gonna we are gonna lose the the fleet, uh, and it's gonna take. I mean, that would be the end of the episode. It's gonna take me like an hour one of these uh, fights I'm probably gonna lose anyway so I prefer to retreat see if we can avoid uh, the conflict until we have a powerful fleet to to actually have a chance okay so re we recruited in, in here we recruited oh war between we don't care we are war with anybody yeah yeah fight themselves come if you want I will kill you all United Provinces and Spain so now they, they will fight uh, these fleets, they will get into a fight as well. Take that away. Okay, so this is gonna take yeah, another turn. Let's recruit now one of the uh, Buccaneers. Boom. And one thing that you may have noticed, we, uh, we cannot... Uh, conduct any research right now because we don't have any any building but in this uh, mode we already have quite a few uh, technologies so we have canister shots so we can actually uh, recruit cannons we have all these uh, naval uh, technologies we reload minus five percent to uh, reload in time uh, more movement Plus five percent movement range, which is pretty good. Uh, look, what is this? Plus ten percent movement range for on the campaign map. 
Yeah, we have a an canister shot. All right. I believe this, that's it. Yes. So what we're gonna have to do is uh, capture uh, Curacao. I think is the the easiest, the fastest. We, if we can uh, capture Curacao, they have. Ah, in this mod, there's no building actually. Anyway, it's empty, so we can uh, build a tavern in there. That is where the pirates study their their technologies <laughs> at the tavern. Ready for action! Ready for action! Let's go. Let's see on the way. Let's see what the they have in Jamaica. They will attack us again, and we will flee like a cowards right now. The units look very nice. I didn't add any, I didn't add any extra mod to this uh, minor, minor factions revenge. The unit cards and all that they, they look pretty, pretty nice. Uh, even though the the portraits are, are not uh, like the Durangos, right? Uh, I use uh, all the the mod compositions that I have. I make uh, combinations, etc., like uh, Ultima Ratio and all that, and they have. With the flags and portraits and all that, but for this uh, campaign in particular and this mod, I think it, they look pretty nice. And for the pirates, uh, oh, I didn't change this. Ah, damn it! The, the first turn, my goodness, uh, Dario. So what do we have in here? So this is very important, actually. Okay, this guy is uh, is uh, garbage. Won't be banned. Any? We need someone with naval. There is a patron. Okay, so who is this? Juan, Juan Davis, Juan Davis, come here and do like that. Boom. Minus two, minus two, plus eight. Minus two, minus two, plus eight. Okay, so it was the same. So you're gonna be there. Now, this guy is, is pretty good. Our vice admiral of the black is here, right? So we have the king, pirate king, the vice admiral of the black. Purser of the black flag, the bosun of the black flag, the marine captain, and the commodore of the black fleet. Very nice. Okay, so this guy plus one man treasury. Honest, uh, an honest pirate. <laughs> ah, we have an honest pirate, guys. Uh, wow, a ton of. Oh yes, yes. Minus one for treasury. One for treasury and one for treasury, so it's only plus one in the end. What about this guy? Bon vivant. Bon vivant. And bon vivant. So the only one that would be a little bit extra treasury is this. Do we have any other treasury guy? Because he's also good for the for the army. Bon vivant. Harsh reputation. That's good for justice. Another honest pirate. Oh, look at that treasury. Oh, this is our treasury. An honest pirate, harsh reputation star holder. Okay, so who do we take out of here? Status quo, minus three claim for reform. That's always useful when we start researching and all that to lower the thing. So this guy we're gonna keep it. This guy is bomb band. This guy is bomb. Band, so any of them. This guy is 25, 28. So the older guy is going out. Where are you? The stall, stall holder, this guy. Yeah. Uh, boom. So you're gonna... This is 366. 366, the same. Excellent. Now, 030. Boom. Minus eight percent recruitment cost for all land units. Look at that. Uh, look at that. I could have uh, saved so much money already recruiting. Plus nine percent to land military technology. Well, that would be later. Minus eight at upkeep for all army units. Okay. Now this guy is Bombi Band. Bombi Band status quo. And what else do we have here? Bombi Band. Harsh reputation. So we're gonna leave it as it is, and when we get new uh, pirates in our cabinet, okay, we so will recruitment. That guy is coming. Navy, one more turn. Two turns, 
and one more turn to get uh, that guy. All right, so we have now these guys. I'm going to move them towards here because our fleets are going to arrive from this area, I hope. So let's see if he wants to come. I'm going to get them all together and then let's see if you attack us, you bastard. All right, so we cannot do anything else. Damn, I missed that, that uh, in the first turn. Um, fleets. So they are on our way. America, America, and route to America. Okay, let's pass another turn. Welcome to America, the land Enemy of the pirates. Uh, we are gonna say, let me, a Spanish fleet. Yeah, Spanish fleet. And actually. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna delete the my old saves. Yeah. All right. And now we flee. Withdraw. Oh shit! They're coming again. Hmm. Well, now I cannot withdraw. We are fifty-fifty. Hmm. But the only thing is that if I do the battle now. Uh, that's gonna be the episode. So what what do we have? We have a galleon, a hundred uh, and thirty fire power, fifty eight guns, but very slow. Speed fourteen and the fifth rate that I love. And maneuver better with forty seven cannons. Forty seven cannons that it will destroy half our cannons in in the first volley. For what I've seen in this mod. Then we have a sloop against a sloop. And the race build galleon against a brick. But the brick uh, is uh, much more maneuverable than ours. Anyway, let's go to battle. Shall we?
Well, that was a long and hard fought battle that uh, I wasn't expecting to win, to tell you the truth. But uh, we managed, we managed. Uh, since I did a few tries uh, in my previous test and uh, until I got a little bit the hang of it. It's very hard to capture ships because they just fight to the death. There was a, that, that sloop in there. I was peppering them with two ships with uh, uh, canisters. Of the, is canister or grape they call in the water? Uh, well, you know. And they just wouldn't give up. In the end, I had to sink the, the bastard and the fifth rate. Uh, we managed to 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 get it. The Aguila Imperial fifth rate is just awesome. So we traded one sloop that we lost it. I used it to to take away the the brick and the and the sloop of the enemy, and uh, yeah, we lost it. But uh, we're in b b terrible condition actually. But uh, we managed. So I'm gonna take it. A fifth rate is a very good uh, very good ship. They are range. Uh, this have 500 and this guy's got 400. I had to get close to it. But enough talking. Let's get the the ship in our fleet. I'm gonna rename that uh, that vessel quickly. And I hope we don't get attacked again because uh, our, our ships are just pff, uh, destroyed right now. And we're gonna call it an episode, uh, I believe gonna be long enough i don't want to make them too long and the battle there's gonna be a ton of naval battles i love naval battles that's why I, uh, the pirates and i can't believe I, I never played the pirates before as much as i like the uh the naval battles so the the united provinces they didn't attack our fleet in here but look at that our fleets arrived we have our pirates of a sparrow look at that first light foot we're gonna call him sack sparrow <laughs> the adventures of sack sparrow yeah because if we call him uh, by his name maybe we get pinged uh, with the um, with the even though even here you see they don't call it Sorry guys, I got the, the flipping antivirus uh, blocking me to, uh, to the desktop. But anyway, so we have the pirates of uh, Sack Sparrow. Uh, just in case uh, copyright stuff, you know. So that's it. Uh, oh, we also recruited actually... Oh, what is this? Prussia and Austria, we don't care about that. Our fleet arrives. So these are the two fleets that are here. Aye, aye, sir. Aye, aye, sir. We're gonna get them together. Set sail. Jump to it and look action. Ship's orders. Aye, aye, sir. Yes, your majesty. All right. So now we have a... That not the best uh, uh, vessels, but we have a quite numerous ship. Now come and attack us, you bastards. They have another fifth rate, I think. Yes, I want that fifth rate. So let's see what we can aye, do. Aye, I'm gonna try to get close to our port though Under sail. If, we, if they attack us then uh, be it we have a, a naval battle and if not well anyway I'm gonna send this Aye, sir. to join them so we have uh, the Widagali sea serpent what's his name uh, Samuel Bellamy Black Sam the Widakali. We're gonna put here Black Sam. Alright. So now, yeah, we have three. Uh, this is a fifth rate actually. Oh, yeah! We have two fifth rates in here. Uh, yeah, we can kick their ass actually. I don't even need to come here. Ship shape and Bristol fashion, we might, I would like to send the trade ships though, keep them safe because I want to try what I mentioned before, send them to the to Brazil, that is the closest, and see if we can get um, some trading from, from that. But anyway, we need to recruit. What are we going to recruit now? 
one turn for all of this so we have riders in on the storm we should uh, gra grab Martinique before the French come around we need to have a look at what's in Curaçao and we're gonna see it actually if I do like this no 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 I want to come this way. All right. Yeah, the the fleet that they had is that over there, and there's nothing more. You are trading. Okay. And um, mm -hmm. I can't see your army. You don't have an army. It's uh, up here, protecting the port. Colonial militia and line infantry. Colonial line infantry. So, how many? Two garrison. So it's not very powerful garrison either. Let's see. Can these guys reach us? Oh, shoot, they can. So, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna. Fleet ready. Run out the guns! Load out the guns! You scurvy dogs! <laughs> Benito Brasiliano. I don't know what that give us. How much? I think 110 is going to give us from there. Okay. So they cannot reach us over there. The next turn we will get into port and get repaired. Our fifth rate that I'm going to rename. Aguila Imperial. going to leave that, that in Spanish. But we're going to call it the Black Eagle. Aguila is Eagle. We're gonna call it the Black Eagle now because it's, you are a member of the Black Fleet. Yes. All right. So I'm gonna leave it here for this episode. I hope you like this. I will check uh, off camera see what we. Well, I don't need to check any. We don't have a, a chance in here. And uh, what did I get before? One of each. So one, one and one. And I can recruit something else. Another vessel. I'm gonna check what to do and I will show you next uh, episode so this doesn't get too long. I hope you uh, enjoy it guys and like, subscribe, all the good things in the, the YouTube stuff. You can become a YouTube member actually in the channel, press the join button, you can see the the, uh, the perks that you get besides uh, early access to videos that I publish like 10 next early access videos uh, for members. I will give you also a, a unit the name of your choosing. Just let me know which, what would you like, a vessel, a, an army, whatever, and we'll give a name that you would like. But anyway, thank you very much for your time. Please take care, be safe, drink a lot, talk with uh, those uh, nice females, be bad. <laughs> and I hope to see you soon with the next one. Ahoy! Bye-bye for now.